Welcome back to PE with Coach K. I am so happy to be back and up and to stay active. And I want you to stay active with me. So today I am going to challenge you, your mom, your dad, your sister, anybody at your house or anybody that you are around at this moment. I'm going to challenge you to a cup toss challenge. We're going to have some fun today and it's going to get a little competitive, but I want to see if you can accept this challenge. So if you are watching this, then you have already accepted. So you're going to need two things for today. You're going to need a cup, a plastic cup. We don't want any glass breaking in the house. So get a plastic cup and you can also use a small ball if you have it, one at home, or you can literally grab a piece of paper or two pieces of paper, ball it up into a small ball and just keep mushing it together so you have your ball. So I have my red cup and make sure whatever cup you have, your ball can fit inside of it. So that's why we want it to be as small as possible. So go grab everything that you need, cup, small ball if you have one at home or a paper ball and come right back to this video so we can get started. So you have accepted this challenge and this is called the cup toss challenge. There are gonna be four different rounds. The final round is optional if you wanna challenge yourself a little bit more. So round one, now each round will get a little harder because every round will prepare you for the next. So round one is very simple. We're gonna do a one-handed toss and we're gonna catch it in the cup, but we are going to see how many successful catches can we get in one minute. So go ahead and set a timer for yourself and we're gonna get started. Make sure you keep count. I'm gonna keep count this time so we can see how many successful catches can I get in one minute. And maybe you can compete and go against some of your sisters or your brother or your mom or your dad or as a family, everybody can do it together. So are you ready? Because we're about to get started in five, four, Get your cup and your paper ball ready or whatever ball you have, three, two, and you're going to toss it up and catch. That's one, two. Try to keep your eyes on the ball so you can catch with the cup, three, four. Can you get more than me? Maybe, maybe not. Five, six, seven, Eight, we got 30 more seconds. Nine, maybe you go higher. 10, oh, I'm on a roll. 11, 12, five more seconds. Ooh, I won't count that. 13, three, two, and one. Okay, so I got 15 in a row. I want you to see how many you were able to get and maybe you won against some of your family members, maybe not. You can also try it again at home on your own time and challenge yourself to get a higher number than you did at this moment. So we are taking it up to round two. You don't have a choice because you already accepted the challenge. Round one prepares you for round two. So for round two, instead of a one-handed toss into the cup, we are going to do a cup toss. So your ball is gonna already be inside of the cup. And you're gonna toss it up and then catch it with the cup. So we don't have this hand. We're only using this hand to toss it up and catch it. So you gotta keep your eyes on the ball so you can know where to place your cup so you can catch it. How many catches can we get in one minute? Go ahead and get ready if you need to shake it off. Shake it off because we're about to get started in 10, nine, ball in the cup, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let's go. And that's one, and that's two, Ooh, three. Can you go higher? Oh, I won't count that. Put it back in, and if it falls, Brush it off, keep going at six, seven. Remember, nobody's perfect. 
We all make mistakes. Oh, but I think I'm on a roll today. <laughs> oh, maybe not. Spoke too soon. <laughs> Put it back. We got 30 more seconds left. Ooh. I kind of lost count, but I hope you're keeping up. Let me just, and if you need to adjust your ball, do so, but we only got 15. Keep going, keep your eyes on the ball. You accepted this challenge, so you can't give up. Now, 10 seconds. Oop. Five, four, three, oh, two, and one more. Maybe not one. All right, so I lost count with my points, but I hope you were keeping up with yours. So now it's time for round three. Remember, each round will prepare you for the next. So round one, we tossed it up, we catched. And if you need to go back to round one, if round two was a little complicated and you kind of want to practice round one, you can always go back to round one and time yourself as well. If you need to go back to round two, if round three is a little complicated and you want to kind of take your time to get to that level, you can also do that. Everybody is different. You work at your own pace, but have fun doing it and challenge yourself to do better every time. So round three. We are going to need a wall. So we have a ball and a cup, and we also need a wall. So I am gonna take you to a wall. We did one-handed toss, catching the cup. We did one-handed with the cup and the ball. Now we are going to toss to the wall and catch in the cup. So find any open wall space. It doesn't have to be huge. It can be small. You're gonna do a light toss and catch it in the cup. So we have one minute to see how many can we get. Now remember, if this is too complicated and you wanna take your time, go back to round two and you can still start at the same time that we do for round three. But are you ready? You don't have a choice. So get ready, starting in five, four, get ready to toss towards the wall, three, two, and go. One, two, three, maybe you step back a little further, four, maybe you throw a little higher, five, challenge yourself, keep your eyes on the ball, six, Ooh. maybe not. Seven, how many points can you get? Can you beat my score? Ooh, talking too quick. <laughs> All right, we got 30 seconds left. I think I lost count, I think this is 10. Oh, <laughs> 11. <laughs> 12, all right, 15 seconds. <laughs> 13, 14, we got five, four, three, two, and time. time. <laughs> All right, so round three, I had you know a little trouble, but it's okay. Remember, you can always go back. If you need to review one of the rounds, you can always pause, press play, and work at your own time and your own pace. So, for our last and final round, remember, we did the one-handed toss into the cup, we did the cup toss, we did the wall toss. Now we are going to go under the leg and try to catch it in the cup. Ooh, that was nice. <laughs> So you're gonna see, and we're gonna do this for 30 seconds. And if you want, you can kind of time yourself. Maybe you wanna go a minute, but we're gonna do 30 seconds since so this is the last and final round and we're gonna see if we can accept this last challenge of an under the leg cup catch with our ball. So we have five. Now I'ma go ahead and demonstrate and I'ma go slow since this is the last challenge. 
And if you accept this challenge, then you deserve this slow demonstration. <laughs> so the way that I do it, everybody is different. You do what you feel is most comfortable and successful for you. So I try to keep the ball close to me when I toss it up so it doesn't go too far and I don't have to move too far or move off balance since my leg is going to be up. So I'm in one spot. As soon as my leg goes up, I keep the ball close. I flick my hand right here and that way I can easily see the ball so I can catch it. Now, if you wanna be fancy and you wanna toss the ball higher and maybe toss it to another angle and then move towards it, you choose to do that. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep it really close and try to get as many as I can in 30 seconds. And I want you to try to do the same. So we are going to start. Are you ready? You don't have a choice because we're starting in five, four, three, two, one. 30 seconds this time, that's one. That's two, three, Whoop. four, I'm on a roll. Yeah. Talk too soon. <laughs> Five. Maybe not. Five. Okay. Six. Seven. All right, we only got 15 seconds. Oop. Keep going. Eight. Maybe not. Nine. Maybe I need to slow down. Ten. There we go. Five seconds. <laughs> Three, two, and one. Okay, I think I got 12 or 11. So, we have finished from round one to round four. Remember, just as a review, if you wanna do this on your own time, you know, you can always rewind back. But round one, one-handed toss, catch it in the cup. How many can you get in one minute? Round two, cup toss. Catch it in the cup while tossing with the cup. How many can you get in a round? No, not how many can you get in a round. <laughs> how many can you get in one minute? Round three, we did the wall toss. Toss it towards the wall, catch it in the cup. And round four, last and final round, we did under the leg and catch it in the cup. So, I hope you had a wonderful time. I hope you laughed, even if your ball fell or not, if you couldn't get it or if you didn't get any points. As long as you accepted this challenge, that's all that matters. You got up, you got active, and that's what I love to encourage you to do. So use this time or whatever time that you have, watch this video, gather all of your family around, have fun, challenge yourself, and make it a little competition. So I hope that you enjoyed this, and I will see you next week for our next segment.